the NFL guys, like, you know, the guys that actually do get caught, you know, they do have somewhat of an issue, right? And I'm more from the standpoint of, like, finding out why Josh Gordon keeps going back. Yeah. It's a reason why. Because no sane person would do it. Yeah. Right? Because in the, even, you know, yeah. the NFL, NFL uh, MLB, they got the best uh, drug testing right. because they get tested one time a year. Yeah. One time. You know what I'm saying? So you know when it's coming. You pass that one test and you yeah. smoke all yeah. 17 yeah. games, right. 16 games. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. NBA is totally different. They test us for random times. You know, we don't know yeah. when it's coming. You know right. what I'm saying? So I always say, like, the guy that get caught, man, I'm like, my thing is, like, I ain't going to sit and blame him. I'm like, dog, what you really going through, bro? Let's talk. Let's yeah. talk about this. The you know NFL, what I'm the NFL yeah. did make a recent tweet because uh, I remember last year, remember Eric Reed kept randomly coming up. Yeah. Um, but you're right. A lot of times these guys only have to pass it that one time and then just move yeah. on from it. Um, if you're able to, because I know this is still an ongoing dialogue, the David Stern meetings, what mm -hmm. were those conversations like? Because he spoke very highly of you afterwards, mm -hmm. and he openly said, I think we're moving to a point where we will remove this off the banned list. Yeah, it was just the same thing. It was just, you know, pretty much educating them. You know what I'm saying? Just really having the same conversation I had with, you know, with most people, like, you think that is, like, common sense or common knowledge is not common. You know what I'm saying? People don't realize, you know, the real benefits of cannabis. And, you yeah. know, even talking to him was kind of examples I was just giving you guys. You know, I was just, just talking to him, like, you know, which player would you rather, you know, you know, have, you know, a guy that drinks and drinks and drinks to cope and calm himself down after the game because you got to think like we're the world greatest athletes like I trained yeah. so hard Bron trained so hard Bron can play four hours not the little hour we play in the game <laughs> yeah. you understand what I'm saying that so, and then, half every yeah, bro. So, <laughs> listen, so you sitting after the game though you still like you still on edge yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying like you mellow still like what's next so now you are trying to mellow out what you go to you go to the liquor so what I explained to him I was like now with CBD and with them changing all the delivery systems and stuff like that, and, and even with THC, I'm like, just imagine after the game, you walk around, the trainer walks around, and he gives out edibles. He gives out gummy bears, right. vegan gummy bears, sugar-free, whatever mm -hmm. you want to make it. But this gummy bear has 100, 150 milligrams of CBD and 5, 10% milligrams of uh of uh, uh, THC, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So now you give them that, you know what I'm saying, with the delivery system, whatever, you know, within, you know, 15, 30 minutes, now I'm starting to relax. Right. Mm -hmm. Starting to cool now, you know what I'm saying? Now my body's healing from within because I got the CBD in it, working with my endocannabinoid system, you know what I'm saying? Good I'm go. on my way. When I uh, when I went to uh, to the, the medical marijuana spot in Manhattan and I was talking to the doctor there, and he was just telling me, he's like, I don't like to prescribe pills. I don't like to prescribe anything. I will prescribe marijuana over any drug. Right. You know, j just the, because the, the, the side effects of doing all that other stuff on your body after a while, whereas marijuana, you know, it's, it's Bro, not. Bro, you got TV. Look at the commercials, though. The commercials is like, okay, try this drug or use this drug. And it's like, you know, all of us sitting playing high five right. on the court yeah. and all that. And then our girls right. skipping away. Yep. And then it's like. Uh, side effects, yeah. instant death, internal yeah, bleeding, I was, I was eyeballs falling minute, out. Like, what just happened? <laughs> <laughs> Anal leakage. I don't want none of this. Yeah, but you, but you sitting there like only thing is my yeah. eye hurt, <laughs> my hip hurt. Like, like right. when did it now, go there? I might when, die, bro. Yeah, nah, I ain't trying to die for this. <laughs> <laughs> it's just my hip, cuz. Yeah. Like, what happened? You know what I'm saying? This is Deontay the Bronze Bummer Wilder, heavyweight champion of the world, and you're watching Real Fans Real Talk. Uh-huh. This is Real Fans, Real Talk. Real Fans, Real Talk. We as real as you thought. Real